they were some of the biggest animals ever to roam the planet. Herds of gigantic sauropods like these Diplodocus dominated the landscape 150 million years ago. These dinosaurs were far bigger and heavier than anything roaming the Earth today. So scientists want to know how their bones and muscles moved this vast bulk. Understanding this could give valuable insights into what our own biological tissue is capable of. These digital animations recreate the skeletons of the very biggest of the sauropods, Argentinosaurus. The University of Manchester team scanned the dinosaur's skeleton and mapped its muscles onto its bones. The researchers were then able to instruct their digital dinosaur robot to learn to walk, revealing exactly how its leg muscles would have moved its huge body. This animal is so big, it's right at the limit of what you can cope with as an animal that lives on land. And things like getting up off the ground would have been extraordinarily difficult, if not impossible. This research is part of a collection of studies published today on what the scientists call sauropod gigantism. The collection also reveals insights into how the creatures would have swept their incredibly long necks over vast surfaces in order to feed. Building up this picture of how the sauropods moved efficiently has revealed just how nature solved a truly immense engineering problem. Victoria Gill, BBC News.